he said that Greek is the backbone of our economy. Since the Greek is the backbone of the economy, I expect every effort that we have to put in for the Greek sector to succeed, we have to. Thank God we went through the estimate, the budget estimate for Minister of Agriculture, the budget estimate for fisheries. You can see that a lot of the policies that the government put in place to safeguard the food security in the country. You can see that a lot of them, I'll put it directly that they are not working. We are not getting the benefit, the investment we are putting into this, uh, how do you call it, uh, policies. We are not yielding anything. For example, we are here, government, when we are going through the, uh, uh, how do you call it, the budget estimate. Things like the, the policies like planting for food and job, they could not even account well for part for uh, for, for, the, for the part one, and then they jump to part two. So when you force the minister to give us the details, the achievement of the planting for food and job part one, in fact, doing the question here and there. So, I think. Nobody is against these policies. They are good. But if you want to ad adopt the policy, you have to adopt it well and do it well. Giving out farming inputs at a subsidized price and other things. Other farming support, extension officer support. The policy running on a neutral ground, you can clearly say no. You those in the farming communities, we are feeling this. Sometimes you go, you're doing a, a political, partisan basis, and are denying people who really need the support. It's a good policy. If it's implemented well, I think government is not pushing, putting much effort. Though their budget is approved for them, we uh, as a committee members who also exercise our oversight responsibilities to make sure that whatever at all they have in the how they, in their budget estimates we also push them so that a Greek sector that we consider it as the backbone of our economy should be on its feet.